being on, on two strikes makes you be at a disadvantage position in the big brother ninja house hello guys welcome back again to my youtube channel my name is vicky and if you're seeing me for the very first time hi please consider to hit on that red subscribe button by your right hand side and subscribe to my youtube channel and do not forget to turn on your notification bell so that youtube will inform you whenever i post a new video so i don't even know why i'm even smiling and please give this video a thumbs up leave me a comment in the comment section and please guys go check me out on my personal channel where i post videos on on family lifestyle vlog and every other in interesting videos are up on that channel like i will always tell you guys not only this i'm a boy a proko and a sherry that i know how to do guys i know how to do other things so if you go to that channel you will really 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 enjoy it please please guys go support your girl by hitting on the red subscribe button for those of you who just fancy me who are loyal who just like me or want to encourage me or want to support me please please guys i beg i just they beg on now oh guys yesterday started yesterday was kind of some sort of i don't know how to say it if it was a a deliberate gang or but whatever it is you guys will say it for yourself or you guys will judge it for yourself so but yesterday started with erica as usual demanding from for more from kid in their relationship and well i don't have a comment for that but erica was seen demanding for more telling kid that she wants more than what he is actually offering her in the relationship your actions the actions are all about. Yeah, well, that's about right. Because I, I told you. I told you. Moving forward, that's gonna stop. No, I'm just saying because you feel that way. That why it was me? Why it was me? Oh yeah, because you try to make it down. Okay, good. Now I'm making a conscious effort to say physical stuff will stop, and we can now focus on um, I, I don't know, fucking romance or whatever you want to talk about. And then moving on, it was actually time for their wager tax, as in like to practice for their wager tax, you get. And the wager was, what Biggie actually said they should do was like mimic or mimic the housemates that have been evicted, you get. So now they are actually trying to, to share roles between themselves. And then you will see that Nengi was trying to act Eric Osho. Hi, I don't understand why Nengi will be trying to act Henry in that particular place. You will see Nengi trying to carry um, lay con. What she's trying to do is that she's trying to carry Lecon to act as if Lecon now is Lilo. And I'm like, these housemates, they are so funny. But be in between those things that were happening, there was some sort of misunderstanding and all hell was let loose. They were shouting, they were like some disagreements. And you know how it usually goes. We all actually said that she wanted to act Katrina in the, in the game or in the play you get. And then I think they were not agreeing with it or they were like, she said that's the only character she can act very well. And and there was some sort of um scattering like people were saying no they, they were saying the guys should ask katrina or something like that and the lady should ask the guys and that was some sort of she disagreeing with them and like usual like usual you guys know how lucy can be lucy is always very 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 difficult you get lucy has always been like if you don't do things our way she is not always having it she's always feeling as if it's a gang up forgetting that it is a group thing and it doesn't it doesn't necessarily have to go your way so after all this confusion and they were not going for that guys dorothy and prince cleared them in fact dorothy cleared lucy and made her understand that things doesn't have to go your way every time and you shouldn't always feel attacked See, lucy you need to be able to separate your personal feelings from our wager or whenever they start a million things i said on that table tricky yeah. or whoever said no yeah i did if you make a tricky suggestion and they say no it's not personal yeah for any reason, it's not personal, so you need to learn how to separate them. Then you went to sleep, knowing that we're doing something here. Mm -hmm. Everybody feels the need to be slow. I feel like it doesn't make any sense. I really did like the way Dorothy cleared Lucy. They are friends, but it doesn't mean that you start licking asses when you see things that are going wrong because Lucy is always very, very fond of that. She is always fond of causing confusion whenever there is tax. That's why a lot of the housemates do not want to work with her. Yes. I feel like it doesn't make any sense. If we're going to do something together, we should do it together. Your feelings aside, if you bring up a suggestion and they say no, no is no. Sorry. We did it. No means no. No means no. 
know. Mm. It's not personal, you see. It's not. And I feel like I need to shut up because obviously I'm not the head of house. Yeah, but well, I like it. And even Prince did clear her. Prince was like angry at the whole housemate. That in fact, Biggie should give everybody one one strike and let everybody just rest so that their body will come down. And then moving on, Erica and um, her boo, Kid Wire. Kid Wire went and was speaking to Erica and was telling her that she, he can see that it's an obvious um, attack or like a gang up against her that he, she should just leave the whole thing for Prince. And that was a very brilliant one from Kid Wire. So yeah, well, don't get stuck into what other people are trying to do and get angry and shout let them do all those things you just need mm -hmm. focused on yeah, yeah i just knew me was Go ahead. i know what she was trying to do today what oh, when? what v was trying to do today when oh, oh, the how whole... long did you take to come out oh well b's already told you that what yeah. you do and yeah, all, and, like... and fair, fair play to prince he was pissed off today so let him let him let him handle the in fact even after this stuff we'll sit down together and, and have another if Erica should want to react to these people, trust me, she is going to get another strike based on the Erica that we know you get. So I just felt like that was a nice one from Kid Wire trying to tell Erica for her to have leave the whole house running or the whole tax thing for Prince. Because at this point, Prince does not have any any strike. So Erica should just sit down, take the back seat and just allow Prince to take charge because if she messes up because she's working on the eggshell and the housemate they know it and they want to leave even though i don't feel like that was their intention or they are deliberately doing it but that is just obviously what will happen if she doesn't know how to handle herself they will deliberately push her out through the disqualification so she has to really really be mindful of how she attacks or how she you know deal with people in the house and then much later even in the night she was really feeling down and she needed to talk to Kid Wire. Kid Wire was just encouraging her that she's a strong person. She should just hold up right there. The show will soon come to an end. That she should just chill and not get herself all worked up. Like they came here for a goal, which is to be number one. We're on, tra well, you're on track. You can't afford to fall into any sort of I miss my friends. If, you were, if they were to replace you with them, they would be like, listen, get over it. And then maybe call you after the show. Oh, hey, what's up? Like, where are you at? There's only three weeks left. If a man wants to go, I'll understand, but there's three weeks to go. Tomorrow's Wednesday, we're halfway through the week. Before you know it, on Saturday, I'll see Sunday, Saloon, when I was getting ready, standing up in front of the Guys, let me just, let me just, let me just say something about it. You know when you get two strikes in a show like this, everybody being, if people want to be strategic at the end of the day, they will want to, you know, trigger you for you to be out of the way because truthfully, it's a game after all and then you are now in a delicate position, you are in a disadvantaged position, so to say. And then people will be like, even if it's not from a hate position, but you know, any way possible now, way because at this very point, if you just if you just make people angry or if you just if people who don't like you which v and erica have not been in good terms even though v's argument during the wager was not from a place of trying to make her rain difficult but the truth of the matter is when you are not at peace with people and you have to strike you have to be wise you have to use your number six you have to just know how you're dealing with them you will not bring out that yourself of um, wanting issues or you just avoid them in fact as then tell you say they mad tell them say yes are they mad if they say jump then they say how high should i jump because at this very point you are looking at your 85 million naira and not looking at what you have to prove at the very moment so that's just what has been going on i just hope that erica really really sail through this thing and she doesn't let her guard lose yet or she doesn't lose it with some housemates because at this very point everybody is in an advantage position compared to she and kid wire because kid wire already had his own two strike and kid wire might even have the opportunity for strong warning but erica at this point has had a strong warning and there is i don't think we are seeing any more strong warning any other mistake would be she leaving the show so she really has to be careful especially with people with bomb they their head like lucy like v because bomb did those people head yes they are waiting for a way to actually explode on you if you do not take care they is explode on you so i just hope that this housemate will just pity erica just forget about 
what she is doing or forget, not push her out maybe if she has to go she'll be from vote or her own doing you get so that's just basically what i came to update you guys i hope you do enjoy this video please if you do please 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 give it a thumbs up leave me a comment in the comment section i really do love to read from you guys and please go check me out on my other channel and subscribe to that channel please i'm begging you guys go subscribe to that channel vicky m channel the link is always in the description and pinned in the comment section thank you so very much for watching my video and i'll most definitely see you guys in my next video <laughs> bye guys